a light portable drone. That's one of the latest gadgets presented here at the Unmanned Vehicles Conference in Washington. Equipped with a small camera, this model is ideal for law enforcement surveillance, but can also be used in map making. It's a multi-purpose invention, part of the booming civilian drone market. What's really exciting right now is the industry is changing. It's going from a predominantly military uh, market to, uh, to opening up for other market segments. We're seeing incredible advances in agriculture, public safety and industrial applications. Military drone making is dominated by powerhouses like Lockheed Martin and Boeing. But small and medium-sized companies are trying to bring the technology to regular folk. Eddie Lin works at Turbo Ace in California, which produces drones used in movies. He says the industry is ripe with opportunities and competition. Uh, it's very competitive because the new technology uh, it, uh, is very dynamic. It changes uh, on a, almost on a, on, on a day to day basis. It makes it quite a challenge to, to keep up with this industry. A challenge Christophe Mazel is trying to live up to. The president of a French company, Christophe, says he too is determined to break into the American civilian market but faces tough restrictions. It's clearly a growing market. What's slowing our progress right now are the regulations which prevent us from using airspace for professional or commercial use of the drones. Drones in daily life, it's a concept that's slowly gaining ground. But these makers are not just out to conquer the skies. Their next project? Drones in the deep blue sea.